Happy Saturday evening, everybody, and welcome back to another installment of Mr. Eric Reads. As always, I am delighted to have you here with me. I just want to give um, a very special thanks to those of you who are watching um, over at Acute Care Veterinary Clinic, Miss Teresa, Miss Corey, Miss Richard. I hope you guys enjoy this story as well. Thank you for taking care of Captain while we're away. Tonight's book is by Judy Sierra. As you know, it's almost like she hired me to promote her books, but she didn't. I love her work. It's Judy Sierra, and this one's called The Great Dictionary Caper. Hmm. So, let's find out what happens on Mr. Eric Reads. This story is brought to you by Noah Webster and his amazing dictionary. Words can get bored. They sit in a dictionary day in, day out. You know what? It's time for a break, they said. So they skate, use a truck, one ride and go. All these words are on the move. The word parade is about to begin, led by the Onomatopoeia marching band, which is, of course, as you know, Onomatopoeia is a word that sounds like itself. So for example, clang, tra-la-la, um, bum, bum, bang, 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 crash, honk, bang, beep, tweedle, boom. Onomatopoeia. Here comes the Grand Marshals, the self-centered one-letter word, and everyone's favorite 34-letter word, supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Action verbs love to show off, like jump and bounce. Run, somersault, whoop, spin, ricochet, ping, 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 and leap. The no action contractions, they need some help. Like, he couldn't, she won't, isn't, we didn't, don't, I can't. Homophones tango two by two, like I and I, nose and nose, one and one, a tail and a tail, the, le the number eight and eight, bear and bear, two, two and two, four, four and four, and three by three, I, I, nose, nose, one, one, tail, tail. Those are homophones. Antonyms play hide and seek. Like hide and seek. Or before and after. Up and down. Day and night. Big and little. Antonyms are opposites. Attention, attention, it's time for the palindrome family reunion. Like, wow, and Bob, and Toot, and Mom, and Dad, and, and aha. A palindrome is the same forwards and backwards. Archaic words strut their Shakespeare like Shakbut, Garboyle, Pismaya, Sneep, Nunkel, Viznard, and Yuck. These are old timey words.
proper nouns are oh so special, such as Florida, Jabberwocky, not to be confused with the Jabberwockies, Mars, Scrabble, and the River Nile. Slippery anagrams always amaze, like how you can make the word rat and the word art out of the same three letters, or dare and read, heart and earth, please and asleep. The same letters can be an anagram for different words. Hmm, who knew? Rhyming words hang out together like fizzy dizzy tizzy, bird nerd word, fly why sky, Bunny, funny, sunny. Those are rhyming words. Words with no rhymes, well, they always feel left out. Like angry and orange, penguin and wolf. What's so special about rhyming? Says the penguin. Grrr, says the wolf. Even the orange says it should be a crime if you rhyme. Interjections interrupt rudely. And we know we don't interrupt, but those would be things like, uh-oh, huh? Arr, yay, yippee, boo, hey. Those are interjections. Even conjunctions can't hold things together. Like, hey or are, yay, then, yippee, do, and, uh-oh, boo, unless, yuck. Those are some conjunctions. Get back in the dictionary, all of you! Sometimes words can spin out of control. Then Roget's Thethoris, that's right, says, Yes, true, verily. For example, my synonyms seem to be plotting and scheming. Like how they should escape, or skedaddle, go a wall, decamp, or take a powder, fly the coop. Things in a thesaurus are similar and all mean the same thing. And it turns out, friends, that that was the end of Judy Sierra's The Great. Dictionary Caper on Saturday night, Mr. Eric Reads. Thank you for joining me. Please continue to like, share, tell your friends, your parent friends, your kid friends, all about Mr. Eric Reads so we can continue to get into every household in McDuffie County and we can continue to promote literacy so that our young readers out there, like you, 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 and you, can become our future leaders. Guys, continue to enjoy the long three-day weekend and I look forward to Monday when I actually see you. Oh, Scratch that. Tuesday when I actually see you in the hallways, but I'll be back again tomorrow night with another book. Take care, guys.